What's going on guys, it's Vash again doing this review-ish sort of thing for the um, disappearance of Yuki Nagato. I was impressed at how the art style, art style is always kind of amazing, you know what I'm saying, with the Haruhi um, Suzumiya series and all that sort of shit, but this one in particular, I was just kind of like, wow, I'm very, very impressed, you know what I'm saying, the subtlety of the scenery, the, the looks on the faces, they, they have gotten, you know, like, Yuki's face is very, very cute, Ry Ryoko Asakura's face, very, very cute. I'm just like wow, this this is very crisp looking animation. I, I like it. it. It's done very, very, very well. I thought it was great. <clears throat> I'm actually interested to see how this shit is gonna play out though, because I really I, I didn't read the light novel um, series on that because that, that, that's a light novel series, right? Like, didn't they turn the disappearance of Yuki Nagato into a manga and a light novel series? I didn't read those. The only bit of information I got about the disappearance of Yuki Nagato was the disappearance of Haruhiso was Mia. When we see Kion in that other world, and we see that Nagato is a very different character, and Ryoko Asakura is still there, and how he goes into the school, that's all I got. That's all I got was that part in the movie. I thought the movie was fucking brilliant. So I was, I'm interested to see how this shit gonna play out. <clears throat> you know what I'm saying in the anime because I don't know shit about it. This particular timeline, anyway, I don't know shit about this particular timeline. Uh, I like that. The uh, affection that uh, Yuki had for Kion is still prevalent and present in this series. And you see that shit in the opening when she's sleeping and he offers her his hand to have her stand up. She's blushing and she's just holding on to his hand. So I'm just kind of like, yeah, it's good to see that. And I want to see the dynamic too, though, between Ryoko Asakura, uh, Yuki Nagato, and Kion. I want to see how that shit plays out. You know what I'm saying? Because this is a whole of the world. It's an alternate world. I just want to see how that shit plays out. The dynamic between the three of these characters. You know, because, I, again, I don't know how this plays out. You know, I don't know if we are going to get, you know, other characters who are going to be involved in this. I don't know. So, I'm just very, very interested to see how this is going to play out. But like I said, so far, I'm very impressed. I like the art style. I like the music. I like the scenery. I like everything. I, I'm impressed. And this is the very first time I've watched this, the Haruhi series as a whole, in Japanese. The first two seasons of the movie I saw in English, so I watched them in Japanese for the first time, so there's that, guys. But let me know what you think about this stuff, though, man. I know this wasn't a real proper review, because I didn't talk about the episode like that, just the opening part or whatever. But, um, yeah, I'm just really, I I'm interested to see how it's going to play out, so I'll give you a proper review on the next one. But as of now, I just really wanted to see what it was like, and I was very, very impressed Please, let's not get another Endless 8 sort of episodes, though. I, I, I don't want to say that shit. We don't, we don't need an Endless 8 episode count. Please, don't. Don't do that, man. But, yeah, let me know what you guys think about all this stuff I'm talking about, though, man. Bash Sam P. Go! What's up, guys? It's Bash, and I want to do this review of this anime I just watched called uh, Denpa Kiyoshi, or Denpa Kiyoshi, I think. Yeah, let me... Denpa Kiyoshi, yeah. 